I learned early on that your paycheck from tennis, maybe that's why I forgot him, should be your small <laughs> should be your smallest earning. Oh, that's my dad always told me growing right. up. Most of my business advice came from my dad early on. Yeah. Um, he is incredibly smart. Even when it came to marketing us as tennis players, I mean Tennis is a very expensive sport and you can't make it from Compton. But I think it was his marketing mm. that got us that attention, that garnered that those press articles that had reporters coming out or else we would have a very difficult time getting out of that in order to make it. But because of the way he thought about it and because of the way the social media wasn't a thing back then. So because of the way he was getting that attention, it was able to push mm -hmm. us up to the top. Obviously, our wins counted as well, which helped keep us up there in, in the early ages, like around the junior stage. Early on, he was like, you know what, you're going to manage your own money. Like literally, he my first checks from whether it was Puma, like I got these huge checks. Um, he never, he's like, you figure it out. And so we had to really? figure it out. And I'm literally living at his house in the bedroom. <laughs> and <laughs> next how, to how, how old are you at this? I was 16. Wow. And he's like, you know, most parents, you know, they, they take your money and right. oh, they take something, but you know, he's like, you figure it out. And so I remember having to figure that out and having to learn how to manage from a very early age.